I'm Courtney. I am the shop mum of Miko and Molly. I have a shop family of five um, and we love what we do every single day. I've been a long term fan of Camilla for a very long time now. Um, lots of you have been asking me to do little videos on uh, how I style my caftans and in particular my turbans. Everyone knows I love a good turban, especially with my caftans. Lily actually loves the headband style, so one of our next videos we're going to show you how to do all of those um, and a few of the other new styles that are out at the moment. We've got this beautiful print in the caftan, the balloon jumpsuit, which is a tricky one to style, so we can't wait to show you that one, and the uh, mini dress with the sheer overlay as well, so we'll be doing little videos on those over the next couple of weeks. Can't wait to show you how versatile all of these are. This is one of Camilla's mantras. She's always wanted her garments to be so versatile, limited only by the owner's imagination, really. Um, and that's really our ethos for all of our brands in our store. We're not about fast fashion. We're not about selling you everything that comes into the store. Maybe that makes us bad in our jobs, but we're about sustainable, ethical approaches to fashion. We want to keep the Australian fashion industry alive and booming and prospering because we have such amazing talent here and we need it to get out to the world and grow and prosper so that more people get opportunities in this industry and that it lives for a very long time. Our daughters can all enjoy all of this. Um, so that's what we're all about here. Uh, so we want to show you lots of different ways to wear your garments. So when you invest in these beautiful quality Australian designer pieces, you can really get your bang for your buck out of them. We want to show you day to night all the different ways to wear them. We want you throwing something like this on to go to a cocktail party, but also lounging around the pool or the beach on one of your holidays. Because how fabulous do you feel when you're wearing something so glorious? You've already bought it for the cocktail party. You may as well wear it around the pool. We're going to show you all of those great looks. But today, let's get started with the basics. We're going to show you how to style these beautiful caftans uh, in probably the most simple ways, and then we'll build on that in future videos and show you some of the more complex styling techniques which will just give you a world of new possibilities. So let's get started. This is the standard way to wear the round neck caftan. Everyone wears them like this. Uh, and they look gorgeous. It's, it's a little bit more of a casual look. I quite like to wear them around the pool or to the beach like this. And some of the styling techniques we'll show you today are going to show you how to take it away from that casual look to that more sophisticated, polished look, more suitable for evening events, cocktail parties, dinners, that sort of thing. So with the round neck caftan, after you've moved away from wearing it like this, one of my favorite things to do is just to shorten it and have a, a high-low thing going on and still wearing it full sleeve so it's got that casual caftan look. Now, sorry if you see my undies, they are Camilla. <laughs> Um, one of the best things to do is tuck the bottom of the band straight into the top of the band of your underwear. You do need a good strong um, banded undie, so something like this, the Camilla ones are perfect because it keeps it in place, stays put all day. So I'm just going to pop that into the top of my undies and then you can control the hem length um, by loosening it out as much or as little as you like. I quite like to keep it nice and short like that. It gives it a cute playful look. You've still got the billowing um, hem at the back, that bubble hem look. This is one of my favorite looks. I wear my caftans like this all the time and uh, just keep it shoulder to shoulder like this with the full sleeve either side. Nice casual look and with the boots. We are going to show you how to change the look with accessories as well. So I'm wearing the Camilla boots today which sort of will cash down a lot of these looks but with a stiletto, you've got a completely different look. So here we are, this is one of my favorite ways to wear it and one of the easiest swaps for this is straight into a one shoulder. You've got to be careful of the Camilla um, tag. I tend to just cut those off because they get in the way. So then you can move straight into a one shoulder, which I quite like. Moving into our next look, this is what I like to call the column dress and there's a few different ways we can do it. This one is as simple as from where we've just been, untucking and you've got a nice loose casual sort of billowy column dress look. Um, some of the caftans have wider neck holes than others, that's just the way they come out. So I tend to, this one you don't have to, it's actually got a really great neck hole for dropping it over and turning it strapless, but sometimes you do need to just tuck, if you've got a great strapless bra, just tuck the tops in here and it will also help you create this really cute little sweetheart neckline. Um, normally there's more fabric and it will tuck all the way in through there, but you get the idea. So that's one way you can create a sweetheart neckline column dress. 
Um, and the next thing, uh, oh, and we will show you how to play with knots, belts, that sort of thing as well. One of the things you can do with the collar dress is tie a knot either with the ends of the sleeve here like this, just to gather in a bit of that fabric and make it more of a column dress. Um, or you can grab from the centre here and tie a little knot there as well, which creates a completely different shape. Don't be afraid to tie silk. It's one of the strongest fabrics and it's made for doing that. So just tying little knots all over the place gives you completely different shapes. Um, and it's a lot of fun to play around with. Really great. As we all know, these Camilla Kaftans are one size fits all. They literally fit from a size 6 through to size 26. We have tried it. So I can guarantee you this will fit a size 26. And playing with the knots, tucking up into the underwear like this, is a great way to get your Camilla Kaftan to suit your shape perfectly. Really accentuate those beautiful curves or create some where you don't have any and hide parts of your body that you don't love. You should, but we all know some of us don't love bits about ourselves and these caftans are amazing for hiding the bits you don't like. This here is one of my favourite little looks, like how I woke up like this. That is exactly this look. Now moving out of our boho chic strapless dress that I absolutely love, just untucked from the undie where we were playing before, I'm going to move into a really chic strapless dress. This one's suitable for cocktail events. Obviously, you probably wouldn't rock your Camilla boot, well, I personally would, but I like to just look like a dork and do whatever I want. And if you're that way inclined, perfect. If not, and you want to play to the cocktail event, you know, dress code, this one's a great one. Style it right up. Some beautiful big drop earrings. The kitty ones that we have online are perfect for that because they're quite dramatic and a great stiletto and a fabulous bag and you're done. Hair makeup on point, obviously. So this one is a really nice one for making your Camilla Caftan a bit more evening appropriate. You can even play with these and tuck them right in so that you don't have to worry about that. Um, so you can imagine with a stiletto heel, great makeup, hair, beautiful drop earrings. This is quite a, quite a uh, sophisticated evening look. Okay, moving out of our strapless dress, I'm going to go back to my one shoulder again. This is going to be very graceful, but this is literally how easy it is, guys. I can do a one shoulder here. Any shoulder will do. You notice I probably just switched it up a little bit I think so this one I didn't show you as well one of our most basic styling one shoulder full length how fab um, and I do love to do a little tuck up here like this expose a bit of the leg create a bit of volume through here voila easy as that Okay, so from where we just were, I've slipped my arm out of the one shoulder. I've got both sleeves here. We're going to do the toga now, which is a really cool look. It's not one that I do very often, um, but I do love it. So maybe I should do it more often. You want to swing your sleeves round to the back. So you've got one at the back and one at the front. And you're going to throw one up here. It's a little tricky to do. Look like a pretzel right now. Where's that sleeve? Here we go. I've got the sleeve at the back now. And you want to bring that up over your shoulder opposite sleeves to opposite sleeves and you're just going to tie that on top of the shoulder and as soon as I've done that you'll be able to see the beautiful ways that the dress naturally falls because we've changed the angles of it. So again another different look. There you go. So obviously you would wear this out and again the boots and accessories will change the look completely. So this can be a nice casual look. Obviously we're talking amazing soccer mum casual, not, you know, everyday casual. Um, or it can be a more dressed up style look if you want it to be. But the good thing about my Camilla caftans is I have actually worn them to countless dress up parties. They work for everything. So obviously, if you've got a caftan in the wardrobe and you've got a costume party coming up, you have the Roman goddess look sorted, especially if you have the matching um, large square scarf because you can tie that into all sorts of different um, headwear that would work perfectly for the costume party as well. So they really are so versatile and such great value for money. 